Happy February. It's that time of the year, the one time out of the year when I really spice it up in here. And for, for everyone in my community, all the customers, everyone on the team, I do a spice up your love life class because why not? Marriage is so important to maintain that connection and to focus on each other. And this month, why not take the whole month and think about ways that we can increase connection? Physical touch is absolutely perhaps the biggest way that we can increase that connection in a marriage. So welcome to Wellness Wednesday, Spice Up Your Love Life, Oils and Intimacy, Oils in the Bedroom. And if you don't know me, hello, I'm Stephanie Stavola, and I'm going to just do a quick little class here on just some ways you can use your oils to enhance intimacy, connection with the love of your life this month. All right, so let's talk about health benefits. And this is actually the 10 health benefits of sexual intimacy, according to WebMD. So number one, less stress and better blood pressure when you have more intimacy in your life. Number two, it boosts immunity. So having sex once or twice a week has been linked with higher levels of an antibody called immunoglobulin. And it's A or IgA, which can protect you from getting colds and other infections. So super good to boost immunity, have more sex. <laughs> Number three, burns calories. Yeah. Number four, improves heart health. Number five, better self-esteem. Ain't that the truth? Number six, deeper intimacy. Number seven, may turn down pain. So this actually boosts your body's painkillers um, when you have the endorphins. So if you have a headache, arthritis pain, PMS symptoms, um, if those things seem to improve after having sex, that's because your pain actually decreases. Um, Number eight, more ejaculations make prostate cancer less likely. Number nine, stronger pelvic floor muscles. And number 10, better sleep. That's due to the release of oxytocin during an orgasm that promotes sleep. So voila, you guys, 10 reasons why this is a very important class and how can we use our oils to spice it up? Aroma and aphrodisiac. So direct link behind essential oils and aphrodisiacs. So aroma arouses the senses, it improves your sexual desire, it lowers sexual inhibitions, and it creates an environment for increased sexual pleasure. Here's some oils to boost intimacy. Now there's actually a handful. So I'm gonna, I prepared a guide, a little ebook for you guys. And so I'll drop the link for you to get that. And it has a full list, but this is just like a few of them that we're gonna talk about real quick. Black pepper, an erotic aroma that adds zest and liveliness to your love life. So it's very warming and it strengthens and penetrates um, and can renew the flames of passion. So this is what you wanna pull out for February. Cinnamon, oh my gosh, be careful with cinnamon. <laughs> that oil will literally like, it's like fire. Um, but when you use it right, use it with a fraction of coconut oil, always dilute. It's regularly used in the bedroom to relight fires, boost sexual desire. It's a warming oil and um, it seductively spreads warmth through your entire body. Also, we've got sandalwood. This isn't a very erotic aroma. I feel like every man should wear sandalwood. So I always love, this is like the only thing I ask my husband to wear. Just put sandalwood on today, every day. It promotes emotional openness. It increases physical sensuality and it helps lovers to get out of a sexual slump. So beautiful oil, uh, Lang a Lang. There we go. That's definitely known as an aphrodisiac oil and it increases sexual desire. It boosts attraction between lovers. It's good to keep in your bedside table. It's also good for sleep. It's good for your heart circulation. It opens emotions and encourages a more sensual and erotic experience during lovemaking. So there you go. Or aromatic bedroom blends. Okay, so try these oil blends that you can actually diffuse to enhance the mood. So black pepper, ginger, and sandalwood. Um, you can diffuse that, or you can mix it with fractionate coconut oil and apply it to your wrist and neck. 
And then let your lover's fire blend is cinnamon, a lang lang and ginger. So same thing, you can diffuse that or apply with fractionated coconut oil. Just always remember cinnamon, you guys, has to come with fractionated coconut oil because that oil is a hot oil. Some oils for her, um, you've got the wild orange, a lang lang, rose or geranium. So this is really good to help with libido and for women. And you can actually just apply this to different parts of your body or you've got the Lang Lang, Rose, Lavender, and Sandalwood. And that's a great perfume. So pull these oils out when you've got them in your stash or add them to your order this month. Oils for him. This is great for men's libido. And I actually have some more libido blends in the ebook. So you've got Wild Orange, Rose, and Geranium again for him. And that's back of the neck, wrists, um, as well as the Sexual Enhancement Blend, a Lang Lang Sandalwood. So screenshot that, show this to your, your guy. This is a great um, gift that you can give your, or just make for yourself and use it during intimate moments. Um, get a pretty little glass jar like this, a little pump jar and fill it with a quarter cup fraction of coconut oil um, or sweet almond oil. And then two drops rose, cinnamon, sandalwood, peppermint, two drops peppermint. And you'd actually massage that on your private areas and there you go. Another thing I'll say with the um, lubes, you can use the yarrow palm or also just the fractionated coconut oil. Those are, and the hydrating body mist as well. Very popular, um, the yarrow palm body serum. You can keep that by your bedside. So they're all great to have um, for that purpose of connection. So for libido, this is a great um, thing that you can try. You can swipe Jasmine Touch from your hip to hip, or you can put Lang Lang and Wild Orange on your pulse points, wait 15 minutes, and you're welcome. <laughs> so massage blends. This is great to uh, make and just use with coconut oil, apply to the back. Um, patchouli, bergamot are awesome with rosemary. You can try again that black pepper and lang lang super sizzling blend and you can put that on the back just for massage you can put it to your thighs inner thighs your bottom so have fun be playful daily nutrients that i can't stress enough you guys it's so important for your libido to make sure that you're covered in your whole in the whole food form um, and so the microplex vm um, mvp and then the z omega that's really important the fish oils um, that's the core of your health. So number one foundation for a healthy libido is to make sure you're getting that supplementation. Mito to max. Okay. This has that ashwagandha in it and that is an adaptogen. So the adaptogens have different healing plants. They, they're unique class of healing plants. So what they do is they help to fix where the body's out of balance and they help to restore the body, protect the body. It's considered the herb of ages. So it boosts the energy levels, it increases immunity and libido for both men and women. This is the top uh, supplement for adrenal fatigue. I am in love with Mitomax. And so it's really great for libido. It's really great for getting you in that good mood. And it's got these adaptogenic herbs in there. It supports optimal mitochondrial function and aerobic capacity. So it supports that stamina naturally without the use of harmful harmful stimulants. So really good to kind of get things going and to kind of spark up your body. That's exactly what this does, where people say this really helps with their mood and it really helps to restore that energy naturally. NAD plus boost. Anytime you can boost NAD in your body, that's where your libido will be restored to. This is just something that I screenshotted from our testimonial group. Look at this. So is no one going to talk about the side benefit of increased libido from a taking the advantage? So many comments. I was laughing so hard reading through this. Um, this is what people are experiencing. And I noticed a difference too, like taking the collagen every day. To, what it's doing here is it's boosting your NAD plus because it has the NADH in it and it has um, the NMN, which is the precursor. So this is going to make your body produce NAD plus. When you have NAD plus in your body, it actually, um, that's what we had in our prime when we were in our 20s. And so libido levels were high in the 20s. So libido, um, is uh, directly linked to NAD plus. This supports healthy sexual function and the desire impacting stamina, endurance, and mood. So I cannot stress enough. There's so many benefits to using the advantage of the marine collagen. We should all be supplementing with collagen. 
Um, but this one specifically targets NAD plus because it has the NMN in there and NADH. So that's why people are experiencing this like better mood and then more attraction to their, or draw like sexual energy towards their spouse. And there's many other recipes guys. So what I did is have this little ebook. Everyone can have this. You can just actually, I'll put the link in the comments and you can actually just opt in and then I'll email you the download. So fun recipes, you guys. It's the beginning. I got this too early. So you have all February to try it out. So do something fun. This is your gift to your husband or wife for this month. Make something, make a little DIY and go have fun, spice it up in the bedroom. Um, We'd we'll love to hear how <laughs> you're enjoying these recipes. All right, guys. Love you guys. See you soon.